Hi, it's Anna Jyoti from the School of Fine Tuning. I just wanted to show you how to set up and work with an on-site massage chair because it's really important that you seat your client in it properly. Otherwise, um, there's various problems or discomforts or injuries that you can cause. So these chairs, there's various. This one's a quick light chair, but there's portal light, earth light, oak works. Some of them are better, more um, some of them are better, more stationary. This is a really good portable chair. So the first thing, the first thing I do is flip up the face hole area, and then I make it steady um, with the base stand. And then I'm going to bring up the chair seated part, and you can see that there are three settings here. So I always put it either on the top one or the middle one. Let's put it on the middle one for now. And then I'm going to put up the armrest and I'm going to put that in the middle one. There's three settings there and this is very various heights. Brilliant. Once that's set up, I'm going to sit down and I'm going to unscrew here. That allows for adjustment of the face hole and the chest. And so I have this rather than up high where it can compress the lungs. I have it lower down, so it's a bit more towards the diaphragm and the lower digestive organs. It's better there. And then this is really important, this top bit. So I'm going to have my face um, in the face hole so that my neck is fully, fully aligned and uh, not scrunching. So this is a good position. You can see here, this is, this is an optimum position where it's just a really nice gentle curve in the um, cervical spine and the thoracic region. My arms are supported, feet are, my legs are tucked in place. I'm fully supported here. This is a good, so some of the things not to do. What not to do is have this too high and bent backwards so that you're like that. So this is compressing the cervical vertebrae here. That's not good. Also, what's not good is to have it so low that you're tilted and rounded forward. This isn't great either. This will make you feel sick more than anything else and so feel a bit dizzy. And then the other thing that you need to be mindful of is that your clients might sink deeply, deeply into relaxation. And what happens is that there, if you can get close up here, is that the chin comes on the bar that's not good. A remedy for if you see your client with the chin on the bar is to unscrew and lower this pole, tighten it, and then just slightly, you can either cut, sometimes tilt this slightly forward and slightly back, or this way and this way. These adjustments give all variations. But essentially, back to how we had it originally, slightly lower for me is here this is very the other thing the other thing that you mustn't do is have it so that you're squashing your eyeballs on the padded area here so you don't want it too low if it's too low when you're here and you're squashing your eyeballs that's not good either so it's got to be with your forehead and your face fully exposed uh, inside a nice curved gentle curve in the, in the spine here, fully relaxed, ready to receive your seated acupressure massage. So the seated acupressure massage is absolutely wonderful, working chi and energy lines, meridians, acupoints. If you're interested in doing the training with me at the School of Fine Tuning, it's a seated acupressure, fully accredited by the CMA qualification, and that allows you to go out into businesses corporate events it's completely portable and just to show you how quickly you can then pack up this is it you pack it up and on your way i wrap mine up in a big cloth but here you're good to go it's completely portable and the treatment in itself is very powerful and very very strong um, i'm yet to do another video i've got a little taster video but i'm yet to do another video that shows all the elbow points and uh, using the heel of your hand points. It's a very, very powerful treatment and brilliantly versatile. It's a clothed treatment. 
So you can go into the workplace and other venues with it, events on the road, festivals, everywhere. So it's brilliant and it's a, it's a 20 minute, 25 minute sequence and it's deeply relaxing but also very energising. So come and train with me. It's Anna Jyoti at the School of Fine Tuning here in Bournemouth. It would be my absolute pleasure. See you soon. Bye bye.